Field S4. Let's do this. Wait, what kind of... Back to map. What kind of gems we got? Armor shredding. I like armor shredding. And what skills do I have? Let's put five in here at least. Just for the armor shredding traps. Let's do trial mode first, so I guess the skills didn't matter. Ooh, and I start with a whole bunch of stuff. I remember this one. I actually like this one. This is the trial mode? All I get is traps. That's fine. I can't even build walls. Nice thing is they'll walk over all of these except for this one is worthless. Oh! No, they won't. They won't walk over this one. Hmm. That one they will. This one they will. This one's good. This one's good. This one is pretty huge. Except these guys will go this way. This one is pretty huge. Um, that one's not bad. These ones are all big. Okay, I wanted armor shredding and I'm getting lots of it. So this top path should be fine. It's bottom now that I'm most concerned with. And I could probably be skipping waves, but this bottom path is a little bit scary. Nice thing is he walks by both of these turrets. Yeah, I probably could have got away with skipping a wave. But we're only doing uh, 20 waves. So it's going up. Let's skip. Skipping on trials, what could go wrong? Everything is the answer. No leaks so far. Ooh, but those are moving pretty fast. Ah, one got through. I probably should have upgraded this one. It doesn't matter. I'm not starting too much early, but a little bit. And I do have to keep an eye on this top group, at least. It looked like half of this top group was going to go down this way. But that's fine if they do. Let's see, still spawning 10 more. But that's good to know that these actually aren't super valuable then. So really, I might want to get these moved. Yeah, elsewhere. Ooh, and this wave's gonna hurt a bit. Okay, let me think. don't have much mana yet. Let's see if I regret skipping those waves. Feel like that's good to do. And of course, right after 
Yeah, I wasn't thinking. Right after I pull out a bunch of my little gems, I get a swarmling wave, which is when I want a whole bunch of little gems. But so far it's not going too bad. Yeah, not many of them actually go through this top, top route. And all of them have to walk by this one. But, a good amount have to walk by this, too. And a good amount have to walk by this. I think this is the one that I upgrade next. And that should have me prepared for this double wave. Which, that double wave is my next concern. Then after that, I think I'm home free. I mean, there's swarmlings here, but if I get through the double wave, I should be able to get through the final wave. This one's nice, because it can even hit these guys. Okay, so now if I needed, I could combine these over to these. Which I shouldn't need to do, because there's no big guys. The final wave is more of the, whatever, zergling guys. Swarmlings. Ah, okay, good, got him. Like, what the heck I get through? Yeah, this seems easy. Cool. Few leaks, which is bad, but also started a bunch of waves early, which I don't normally do for that trial mode. Slowly getting more skill points, which I like. Let's do endurance. I don't know if it's better for me, probably better to weaken the difficulty and actually complete these, but that's fine. Oh, I do have armor piercing, and I do want to kill this. Or armor shredding. And for this one, they're mazed correctly, plus I can maze them even more. But, psh, I like this maze. Most I would do is make sure they have to walk over this one. But yeah, no, that all looks good to me. Hmm. How many waves to start with? Do we start five? And just not care much about this beacon? I think so. The thing that sucks about that beacon is unless I get... Well, there's no reason not to. Like, unless I set one gem to just ignore, to only target structures, They'll always be busy because it's right up front and they won't try and target it. That works. And I can even upgrade that gem. First, let's see how everything does. So far, so good. And I have these backup turrets for when stuff leaks by which will be now, but not much stuff. If I was this guy, yeah, 50-50 chance which way he'll go. And he went this way, like Pachinko. Drop the little marble down, watch which slot it takes. Ooh, these are gonna hurt a little. But who cares, they're swarmlings. If one or two get by, it's not like it hurts that much. These are starting to hurt a little. 
So, maybe it's time for me to maze. Ah, stupid swarmling. He is killing me. It didn't kill it. You gotta be kidding me. I'm gonna spend 120 to kill this one stupid thing, but I need to drop a wall here, so I had to kill it. I don't need to, but I want to drop a wall there. Okay, now, how do I want these to have to go through here? I would like them to go down here, up here, which means block that, block that. Yes. And... This one swarmling doesn't matter. I'm trying to think, do I need another turret? And I th or tower. And I think the answer is yes. I could also upgrade all these others. Would be nice. God, that's a ton of swarmlings. Eventually got through them all, but that hurts a little. Do I want... Oh, no, I guess not. I was gonna say one mana trap. Maybe. I'll say yes. And... How are armor levels looking? Still pretty low, but by the end of this they'll be higher. And how is this speed beacon stupid thing going? Okay, its armor is gone. Let's kill it. That's killing it quickly. God, that's a lot. But I have three of these and a semi maze. Not like great, but good enough that they have no chance. And I killed that thing. Let's put you back to nearest orb. Really, right up front, I would like armor shredding. Times three each. That spends a lot of my mana, but I think it's worth it just to get rid of all their armor right off the bat. Or almost all their armor. Nah, that's pretty much. Now, that might have been excessive, but I think I can skip. <sighs> yeah, that was probably excessive. Instead of that, I probably should have just let my mana pool build up. these gems or can I let my pool there we go the pool finished I think just spending one of those will be enough yeah more than enough Good, because I'd like to get these upgraded or get them enhanced with the spell Probably have to stop skipping pretty soon because the hit points are going up. 500. Yeah. 
Let's do another one of you. Make use of all the free turrets they gave and the free traps. This level's a pretty nice one. Oh, some of these are about to leak by. I might be able to stop them with a bolt. No. Did that stop them? I can't tell if one of them got by, maybe. But a bunch of these are about to get by. So I don't want to spend all of my mana, but I expend a good amount. That's painful. Super painful. Kill them. Having a bolt to spend right now would be nice. And somebody kill this. They can't. God. Is that all because I skipped a couple waves? Probably. Okay, it's way too late game for me to be skipping waves is what I'm learning. That might kill me right there. That's definitely gonna kill me. Those upgrades were a mistake, but I was gonna lose anyways. I'm pretty happy with that. Let's do R1. Armor shredding is in here. Let's knock out the trial mode. So far, I don't think any of the trial modes have been too bad. They're not super easy, but they're not bad either. Oh, I only have a lantern and walls and the amplifier that I get for free. Amplifiers. Oh, but they start me with a ton of mana. Okay, so I want these guys all to have to come by here. How do I do that? I can't. Um... Maybe I can. I definitely can. Why did I just do that? Okay, so the plan is to have all these guys come through here. Have all these guys come through here too. Yeah, I think that's it. And what do I want in the lantern? So I can build another lantern too, but to start with, I think I just want one super amplified one. Because the next one's going to have to go right here too to make use of the amplifiers, I think. I could build two more good ones, but this one's going to be the best one. Probably could be skipping waves just because that thing does splash damage anyways. And how many waves do we have total? 22. Screw it. Let's skip a couple. I'll probably regret that and end up having to restart, but maybe not. Oh, 
that's a good amount leaking by. Not enough to lose it, but enough that I'm afraid to be upgrading gems too much. Okay, so this weak gem doesn't really do anything. Oh, it just did there. Couple leaked by. <laughs> Overall, this one doesn't seem too bad, but it's not great. Probably more worth it to get a grade 5 in here than it is to build another tower with another grade 3. Or another lantern. And I'm not sure if these are worth upgrading or not. what happens. Huh? I mean, a scary thing is what happens when big guys start coming towards the end. But right now, I could upgrade that. I can't do that. The main thing is by having a big gem in here, it does one hit kills anyways, so this second one is kind of just a waste. So it's good to know if I replay this one, but hopefully I don't have to. Is you mostly just want a really big gem and then supporting gems. Do I want to upgrade those two supporting gems? I guess so. And then I think I just see what happens. I might need some of this remaining mana to do banishments, but these guys don't look that strong. 91 hit points. So two hit kill, pretty much. Yeah, should be good. Not too bad. This lantern was kind of a waste, but not bad. Ooh, plus 20 initial mana sounds high. For unupgraded. Let me go see my talisman. How many levels? It only has three levels, so I guess it's not that good, because this one has four levels. How much is it to unlock these? 400 shadow cores. I can sell a bunch. Like, I don't know that I need to keep all of these. Probably not. I probably really don't need any of these because I'll be getting better fragments as time goes on. Endurance mode. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh, lanterns. I'm so torn on how I feel about these. Should I at least? I think I should. End endurance. Confirm ending. Yeah, just get out of here. It gives you it even if you didn't... Oh, they've got like a little hole in the middle, I guess, if you tried it but didn't finish it. But really what I want is to get rid of you. And go heavily into lanterns. Do I want more heavy than that? Yeah. Let's do it. Which one was that? That was this one. Okay. So if I'm doing it where it can shoot 10 at once, then I should be starting waves early, I think. Let's get one in there. See if I regret doing five. And I could, and I will, make these guys walk around. Oh! I'm an idiot. Restart the battle. I needed to place one wall here. And there's also a wizard stash that... Oh, I can place normal turrets. Why did I think that I had to use lanterns? Well, I'm going to do lanterns because I haven't done much with them, so why not? But maybe not pure lanterns. Okay, I'm actually not going to build too much wall then. Because I can build turrets that also make use of this amplifier. So the best way to do that, one, two, three, four, five, six. I should not have built this wall, but I can destroy it later. For now. Let's only skip the first three since there's swarmlings. is it to combine? 226. That lantern is doing good work. I don't know how much good a lantern in the back is because I would hope to have it thinned out, although I don't right now. Wow, yeah, I really don't. What do I want to do? I think right now I would like to build a turret here, to move this here, to upgrade it once, and to do that. A bunch will still leak through, but less. This one needs to be upgraded. Okay, mistakes have been made for sure. Skipping waves might have been a mistake. By might have, I mean almost certainly was. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nope. Um, what do I want to do now? I feel like without skipping waves, though, this is an interesting map. So I'm gonna finish it until whenever I die, but I'm probably gonna play it again. And I think the lanterns are pretty good potential. That was probably stupid to upgrade. There we go, that's better.
And I'm ready for a flying guy to show up. I saw the screen flicker. Multiple times now. And I can build a turret or a tower wherever I need to to take advantage of that. Let's just get Ignore's Armor. Oh, it's only for seven shots? That's kind of lame. I thought it was forever, like with the traps. Speaking of which, I do need to build some traps too. Okay. And I need to build more towers around my amplifier. All right. Yeah, so this lantern I don't actually love. Let's see. Going to build a tower here, but not here. Can't build there. I think those are good. And I mostly wanted that so that I could use my spells. destroy that wall that I made. Ah, that destroyed more than one wall. I only wanted to destroy one. Nice. Okay, I feel pretty good about this right now. This thing has 255 kills. Okay, I was feeling pretty good until stuff started leaking through right now. A lot of stuff started leaking through. More stuff than I can handle. That hurt. Let's do upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Does this do anything to an amplified gem? No but it does stuff to these. How's our armor looking? 56, armor's going up. This thing has a thousand armor. I should be taking that out. And really, Low on mana now. I should leave this in here just to shred armor, even though hopefully their armor's low by the time they get here. But hopefully it's not enough. That's game over. Okay, so yeah. I'm going to redo this one next recording and see if I can do better. Highest wave, I only got to 22. I left an apparition alive, I didn't even see it. I remember seeing the screen flicker, so I'm also going to watch for that. Okay, R1 I'm redoing. Alright, thanks for watching.